All right, guys, shoot tits here, and uh, I'm doing updated gear bag on my stuff, so let's get started. All right, first things first, let's get started with my gloves. So uh, as you can see, I got some new gloves. I got the uh, Die 08 Meta gloves. I think it's spelled M-E-T-A. And uh, I've used these gloves now about three times. And the thing I really like about these gloves is, one, I like how they have a lot, a lot of padding on the arm, like around like right here. That has a lot of padding, especially like if your arm is exposed, like when you're shooting, or especially if you're sliding. Like I slid with these, I do Superman slide. They were great because uh, one of my teammates actually has a huge scar on his hand because he wasn't wearing gloves when he did a when he did a Superman slide, and I didn't find I didn't have any problems with these. So uh, another thing I really like about it is how the strap works. The strap basically uh, it just wraps around your wrist, and it just feels really really good not like some of the other gloves like my old gloves before like sometimes the strap would come off and the gloves would get loose uh... another thing i liked about these gloves was this part right here so uh... where where actually the wrist goes as you can see like past your wrist it has this like silk material that feels really really nice and it's really comfortable and uh... it works especially good for me because it goes over my elbow pads and uh... That's about it for good. Now, some things I don't like about this is um, this little thing right here. How it's like a little wedge. How it cuts off the fingers. It actually holds uh, these three fingers right here. Your pointer finger and your thumb. So it sits kind of like that. And uh, the reason why I don't like that gap is because it actually slows you down while you're walking the trigger. And uh, so if you're like on a team and you guys are playing like straight semi or something like that, it might slow you down. And another thing I like with these gloves, I just found out, as a uh, flip them inside out, if you kind of sweat really easily in these. Like when I took the, when I took these off, my hands weren't even sweating, and like the inside was like really moist. But uh, this is the first time this actually happened to me. I don't know, maybe just because it's really humid outside. But um, that's just, those are the only two things I don't like about this glove. But besides that, I really recommend this glove. It works very, very nice. Okay, moving on. Another thing I got was, I got me a pump gun. So, uh, this pump gun actually did not look like this. Um, I, as you can see, like if you can see the bolt right here. The bolt right there it used to be all corroded and it was all, it was all messed up. The gun didn't even shoot. As you can see inside the breech, you can see the how the bolt's gold. Yeah, before it was just like black and dirty. And uh, the pump works really nice. It actually used to use an ASA, but I took it off because I had a leak in the regulator. And now I just attach it straight from the back, and it kind of like just like sits on my back. And uh, basically, what I'm using right now is I'm using, as you can see, these 10 round tubes. And uh, they hold about like, yeah, like probably like 12 rounds because of the feed neck but yeah this is basically what I'm using right now I have not used this in a game yet uh, I haven't been paintballing in actually like two or three weeks um, another thing I like about this is it has an auto trigger as you can see it has an auto trigger and um, that's about it oh also uh, I painted the gun it used to be uh, it used to be like this weird color. I don't know. It looks like somebody just like sharpied it. And then, um, but yeah, I painted it. I used like this boat paint, I think it was. It's supposedly like never supposed to rub off of the metal if you wait like two hours. But I didn't wait, and you can see the pump arm kind of like scratched off the paint. I have to repaint it. But uh, that's it for this. Uh, I really like it. I haven't used it yet in the game. But um, you'll probably see me later. I'm playing with this. And I have two of the 10 round tubes. Alright, another thing, as you can see, since it's right here, is that I got a caddy. Um, I finally picked up a caddy. I didn't have one before, and I got one. I really like, I'm really liking it. As you can see, it's holding all my paint in there. And, um, uh, yeah, I really like this. I definitely think this is, this was worth 25 bucks. As you can see, it works really good. No paint will fall. Works perfect. Okay, another thing, you know, uh, finally got me a new jersey. 
I picked me up a 2010 Titan Eclipse Distortion jersey. The jersey is really nice. Um, it has a lot of padding as you can see. It has it on the chest, has it on the shoulders, the forearm. It just has it everywhere. It works really good. It has a lot of, I guess you can call it venting. Like, you don't really sweat in this jersey. And plus, it just looks really nice. And uh, I got the Digi camo color just to match my pants. And, uh, yeah. And I got a really big size just so I can get bounces off it. As you can see, I got an X large. I got two sizes bigger than what I normally wear. But um, that's it for the jersey. Okay. So, another new thing I got was... Nope, sorry. Uh, okay. I got me a feed neck for my gun. Um, it actually does not fit. It's too big. Uh, I think this feed neck is called the Isle Cocker Share Fit Clamping Feed Neck. Uh, it was under the section for the Synergy, my gun, but it was too big. So I'm either I'm either going to modify it. Or I'm gonna try to send back to the. Or I'm try to I'm gonna try to send it back to the company. Sorry, got the hiccups. Yeah, so I'm either gonna modify it or try to send it back to the company. Um, it was just like a cheap little feed neck. I just want to see if it would fit. I think I spent like 20 bucks on it. That's it. But um, yeah, it's too big. You know, I don't know if you can see that, but if I actually if I try to put it on, it's too big. So I'm actually gonna try modifying it if they don't want to take it back because WGP just has the worst customer service and um, one other thing I got I actually forgot is um, I, I got a Planet Eclipse CD that came with uh, that came with the stuff I ordered and uh, I found that most of the stuff on there is actually on YouTube so uh, that's about it guys that's all the new stuff I got for now I'm definitely getting uh, a lot more new stuff and I'll let you guys know in another video what I'm getting. So thanks, guys. Uh, please subscribe. Shoot tits.